Oh, right, guys, today we are going to be reacting to Andrew Humble's delusional 36 year old who only this millionaire. Let's jump in. <laughs> I'm just going to ask you one question, right? And I already know the answer to it, but I'm hoping that you surprise me. You'll be the one who surprises me. What is it that you bring to the table for this one percenter? Besides a place for him to stick his ass, what do you what do you bring besides a place for him to stick his to the table for this one percenter? I give great massages. One guy actually quoted me as my healing touch. I have a healing touch. He can tell he was oh, getting better what? just from the massage. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, now he's a one percenter. He makes 500,000 plus a year. He can go to a professional masseuse whenever he feels like it. Have one come to his house and give him the happy ending on top of it if he wanted it. True. What, what, what besides the, you know, his calves are going to feel really good after you're done rubbing them, uh, are you bringing to the table? Also, if I may jump in, are you, you say you'd, you'd give massages, are you like, have you been trained? Like, are you a massage therapist? No, it's like a natural. I just got it. Uh, but do you think you're better than like oh a my massage God, I didn't therapist? I didn't, say I didn't it. realize, man. Oh, this, that, this one's a rough one, man. Oh. Oh my God, it's a rough one. Oof. I want to keep it just YouTube friendly, but you know, you guys know what I'm talking about. Man. Better. But so... You guys asked me what I bring to the table. Okay, I yeah, bring yeah. massages, yeah, yeah, no, no, okay? That's fine. You that's want anyone else? I cook. I clean. I am fit. What else? I'll do everything. So. Wait, what else do you bring to the table? I cook? said I cook, cool. I clean, I'm fit. I would raise fit. the kids. Face the kid. Um, yeah. I mean, I, I'm a very generous lover, so. Like very basic me, shit that every know. woman can do. Literally basic shit that any normal housewife does. Stays uh, at least somewhat fit, right? Raises the kids and is uh, somewhat decent to their man. And for this, in exchange for all of this, the thing that every other woman can bring to the table, you want a millionaire. You got it, you figured it yeah. out. Yeah, we didn't even need math. Can I say something about this? Like, I feel like guys with money, they don't really want like girls that like bring a lot to the table, like financially speaking. So maybe it's probably best that she, she you know, can bring like what you're no, saying. No, no, you're right. You know, listen, listen, I agree with you. Because then they have that, like, a competition or whatever. Yeah, I agree with you mm -hmm. that a, a millionaire doesn't care what your net worth is. He doesn't give a yeah. shit if you're a barista at Starbucks, right? But yeah. he has his pick from the hottest fucking women on the planet. The hottest women on the planet are going to be pursuing your multimillionaire. You're saying and she's it's not like, hot? That's what I'm asking. So, I want to so be like, dude, do you is, know what I look like? The thing is, is like, uh, I, I'm looking at you right now. I know, you're looking at this half. I mean, the, the other half better be made out of solid gold, 24 karat fucking ingots, because what you're competing with in the Los Angeles area is some of the most beautiful women on planet Earth. And I, all you bring to the table is you're going to give them a nice massage. It's yeah. like, uh, oh, Crazy. okay. You, you could see, you could see where my extraordinary skepticism would come into play where I might think perhaps this is moderately delusional not only are you going after 0.1% of the population but out of all of the various competitive uh, women that you'll have also going after 0.1% of the population you think that you're going to outcompete them because you give really good massages that doesn't sound remotely insane to you at all I'm not worried about it boo-boo <laughs> wow and wait, remind me, your age, you're 37, right? 36. Oh. <laughs> you can't give him kids either. <laughs> wow. What? Actually, oh, my God. Oh, where did you find her? Where did you find her, Brian? Where yeah, yeah, I was asking the same question, man. Where did does Brian find these kind of people? How is this person normal? <laughs> oh, man. A uh, woman, bring me a drink. Bring me a drink, woman. Oh my God! I can't, how am I going to get through this show tonight? How am I going to get through this? Tonight? It's rough. It's rough. Okay. So to get this right, you're almost 40. You're almost 40 years old, right? The biological clock is pretty much clocked out at this point, and you want a multi-millionaire, 0.1 percent, in an area that has the most Tons beautiful of young 20-year-old women on planet Earth. Is that does that summarize your position? Yes. Wow. Can't make this. A, they, I you think can't she make did this say up, she man. already has millionaires. 
Yeah, Where's, I'm not honestly worried. Yeah, about yeah, whatever. And I keep already laughing, have a Pegasus. Keep laughing. I mean, sure. Yeah, I have a Pegasus in my backyard. I fly him around sometimes. <laughs> when I'm going to the corner store, I hop on the Pegasus. It's awesome. I have a little sword. I take a McLaren. I put the sword on. I have the sword on to jump on the Pegasus Lambo. and fly off to the store. You know how Ferrari. it goes. Mm -hmm. We don't know her life. <laughs> uh, there we go. Demons are starting to just help each other. I, yeah. Man, you said that you have a roster? I'm done talking about it. Well, uh, no, I mean, don't. It's okay. This guy's going to berate me. We're no. Good. We're totally good. He's, Andrew is just. He's clearly what do you got mean? it all I figured out. you at all. Yeah, just, Hang on. What did I say that was berating to you? I mean, you're putting me down, because you're I'm laughing in my face, and you're acting like I'm crazy. You said Boy, I was delusional. I'm sorry, but... Uh, Aren't, I'm isn't sorry. everyone pretty much delusional? you got to manifest no, no, what you want. No, I don't think everybody's pretty much I'm delusional. Everyone I think does, that, generally speaking, most, most rational agents, what if they heard this, my watch died. At, at nearly 40 years they old, I want a 0.1% guy uh, in this population where there's a sea of beautiful women that he has to choose from. Okay, and what I'm going to bring to the table is that I'll have sex with him and give him a massage. How, who wouldn't think that that was delusional? That's not berating you. That's it's just me being honest with you. I have a question for you. Do you think like... Here, you know what? I'll make you feel. I'll lie to you. Oh, you know what? Oh, you go, girl. You know, get yourself that 1% doesn't exist unicorn. I'm sure you can do it. it. Excellent. You know, from now on, I'll just the whole show, I'll just lie to you. Haters going to hate, but I just love, love, love. We see. What does that mean? Haters are going to hate, but love, love, love? What, what does that mean? How is that even an argument for a conversation like this for somebody that's almost 40 years old? Am I crazy? I'm glad that Lisa uh, Andrew's here to just, you know, put his two thoughts because if I was only just watching this from the female point of view, I would just drop, I'll be dropping IQ like a fly, man. I mean, it's crazy, man. So, Teresa Judice. We see you all the time. Like, what? Exactly. Do you th like, so me personally, like, I'm, I'm 35, right? And... Do you think I could like get, you know, like a Victoria's Secret model, like a baddie Victoria's Secret model? I mean, model? if she liked you, yes. It's gotta be in your head, right? Mm. Girls are different than guys. Like they're if you th you think women date below I, all the time. You think me with my like mid-tier YouTube? If you podcast, were nice, I'm if you were nice, I think because of nice. the YouTube podcast, you probably could pull, but a, a Victoria's. What do you mean? Supermodel? Women don't like Not, nice men. Especially they, don't like men. they like men who go to prison. That's who they like, right? <laughs> Are you being shady? Isn't that yeah. who they like? No. Wait, don't so, shave. Okay, okay. So. Don't shave me. I thought you were doing stuff. Well, my what? question is, how would he get in contact man, with Man, that, that, that one on the red, man, she looks kind of freaky, man. I'm not going to lie. She looks freaky, folks. Man, she looks kind of freaky. I'm not going to lie. Like that. I think that's how the point. I, how would I? Yeah. I mean, we're just the end like, That's Instagram. like the we point is NBA you match No, but I'm values. old. I'm not, I'm not going to settle until I get a Victoria's Secret model, a 19 year old Victoria's Secret model. Love that energy. You just have to plot your way there. Basically. I'm holding out. I am holding out. <laughs> okay, so I'm glad me you know with my dad bod. But you're not a my, girl. So that's what? delusional for you. It's harder for a guy. But it's many men who still fall in love every day. Like, you don't what? know. That, that made sense. Um, I think it does. Like, you don't have the type of... You got to straighten your mic up. And okay, you don't mic. have... You don't have what women have. Wait, can, just leave your, the mic where okay. it is. Move it, move it to the edge of the table. Okay, there you go. Go ahead. You don't have what the women have. What? What, what does that mean? No, you don't have to have sex. I just told you I was celibate for two years since one relationship. Like yeah. Do you guys believe that she was celibate? She could. Not like, don't get me wrong. She probably could. But do you guys really believe it? You don't have to have sex or do nothing. I think you're just jumping to conclusions that that's all people want. It's actually some mm -hmm. people who never be seen and one person can come see mm -hmm. you for you and then you can love them. It's actually that's just female Brad. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. I'll see you in the next one.